Praise Jesus, Cornelius speaking here. Just a quick testimony I want to share of what happened just over the last, eventually over the last five, six months. Uh, we happened to go down at Logan, um, down there in um, crossroad from the police beach near Woodrow Station. And I met this young guy and um, this young guy was really open to, to the gospel and what Jesus um, what Jesus talks about in the book of Acts and, and also in John 3, that we must be born again of, of water and spirit uh, to enter into the kingdom of God. Anyway, uh, I actually didn't see him for some time, but on Saturday, um, I actually saw him again. We're out there tra um, training some other um, young disciples to pray for people and, and stuff like that. And so what happened is, um, anyway, he comes there um, and by divine Holy Spirit appointment, um, I happened to, you know, obviously take him to down to Binley in the way that I was traveling late in the evening around midnight because he needed a lift that way. Um, so anyway, I got connected with him the next day um, and the following day on Tuesday, yesterday. And um, his dad, uh, I happened to meet today and his mum because he invited me to go to their house in the morning. And so anyway, we took him out, we went out for a coffee and we sat down and um, I took him through the gospel presentation, the dad and the, and the son. And so out of this presentation, um, it was really amazing because there's a lot of conversation around, you know, repentance, around, um, you know, being water baptized and, and uh, healing and deliverance that comes by us believing in Jesus Christ and the forgiveness of our sins. And he can start a, a fresh start. Anyway, we prayed and uh, following that through this object lesson that I, I showed, uh, because the book of Acts does say, in, in, in 36 that all the people of Israel then who to know for sure that this Jesus whom you crucified is the one that God has made Lord and Messiah when the people heard this they were deeply troubled and said to Peter and the apostles what shall we do brothers and Peter said to them each one of you must turn away from your sins repent and be baptized in the name of Jesus Christ so that your sins will be forgiven and you'll receive the gift of the Holy Ghost wow and so anyway we followed through with um, some conversation after prayer and they're willing to do more um, Bible discovery and lessons uh, up ahead so we're willing to follow up on that and um, also seven eight weeks ago we we did a kickstart training we we um, help people you know, go on the street and pray for people one young man got spirit filled um, you know that came to the house anyway I happened to um, you know keep on in the phone with him and um, and and recently he's want, want to make a decision to follow the Lord Jesus and be baptized and receive his forgiveness so tonight um, my brothers and sisters we are baptizing to Jesus Christ um, and um, taking him through repentance and we want to see a new life and, and freedom over him today is, is the day and this evening I'm looking forward to what God has for this young man in store God bless you amazing testimony amazing Lord thank you Jesus